I, I think that one of the main uh, reasons of why we celebrate the 5th of May here in the United States, it is because the president of the United States wrote a letter to the Mexican president congratulating him because, uh, because of the big effort to defeat the strongest and largest army in the world. And three days later, uh, in California, happened a big celebration. And from then, it is a worldwide celebration, but it is misleading. They think that is Mexican Independence Day. What we covered today, it, it was the 5th of May on or the Cinco de Mayo. We were trying to educate people that it is not Mexican Independence Day. It is a battle that uh, Mexico fought against France. So Mexico uh, in, the, in the 1800s was having a civil war. France, Spain and England invaded Mexico. England and Spain, they retrieved, they went back, but as France stayed and the president of Mexico, Benito Juarez, in that time uh, called a draft to all the men of age 54 and younger to, to be called to duty. But when the, the French army came and invaded Mexico, it became one whole country to defeat the strongest and the biggest army in the world. Right now, the 5th of May is a celebration, a big celebration here in the United States. But I think they are forgetting what is it about. They just went to party and they don't remember that it was a battle. It was a symbol of unity and freedom. Yeah, it was hard work because I need to research for so much information to put all together about how to inform people. They need to know about the history of the day, how friends decided to invade Mexico and why. So, when I need to research everything. Well, Adams State has um, given me so many opportunities to uh, expand my horizons and to become more knowledgeable in things that I did not know. And my, I, I'm a double major, so my second major is Spanish as well. And I think that once I finish my, with my college education, I plan to travel the world, just take some time off studying and, and everything, so just go and travel the world, learn by experiencing new things. Mm -hmm.